Please, oh please, it's obvious. I'm gonna be telling you about my lucid dreaming experience that I just had the other night. And so this was the experience, right? Okay, so it started out like this. It wasn't, I wasn't lucid at first, but I'm with my best friend, Bismarck, and we make music together. So we were in, some, we were at some place, right? And we're working on a song and I'm kind of like, we're like looking for beats and then we, we get a beat and then I'm just trying to like, I'm just kind of like rapping on it and singing, trying to find like the perfect sound for this beat. And I sounded like so like crystal clear, like amazing. Sometimes it would sound kind of off, but then like once I got the pitch, it sounded like super great. It was like the auto tune and it was already on there and I was just hitting all the notes. After that, some other stuff happened and then all of a sudden, so, I'm jumping oh be hidden they don't want you know of your power Ooh, I be going ghost like I'm in the air so sneaking out now all of a sudden I'm jumping across these boxes these boxes sticking out of the ground and I realize I'm lucid and I'm just like freestyle rapping I'm just freestyle rapping like it was the best rapping in my whole life it was like some of the, literally some of the best rapping it was just flowing so well so naturally and so all of a sudden I'm, I'm running around and these different beats start playing and I start rapping I start freestyling over it and it was like one of the best freestyles like I ever made it was just flowing so natural and I barely even had to think about it so that was like super exciting and as I was even rapping I was just I was even as I was rapping I was thinking about how good it sounded and it was making me so excited and and, and I was outside and there was these boxes just laid out all across and I started jumping on them and as I would jump across each box it would play different beats so different beats would play as a jump on each box and that was like super cool and then I get off the box and then I'm just looking around and it was so vivid and so realistic I remember just thinking to myself like wow like this is so incredible and it's it's a shame actually because I can't remember exactly what it looked like I remember there were some trees around me and it was sunny it was shining and it was it was really beautiful and in front of me there was like a plane or a boat and I and I can't remember exactly what it was but I walked over to it I walk over to it and then I'm starting I'm starting to think like you know I can't think about how I'm lucid dreaming because if I think about it too much I might just wake up and I don't want that to happen and then I'm starting to think like maybe I can do affirmations in this lucid dream so that I can manifest more in waking reality and then all of a sudden I'm just like I'm, I'm just in this like room I'm, I'm just in this room and there's like this wall in front of me and it's just this white wall and it has like this really interesting like texture on it I, I don't even know it's like almost um uh, like the popcorn ceiling almost you know what I mean and it's almost like that but it's like solid and and so I'm starting to think to myself like I want to see like if I can like I want to see if I can push this wall back by just my mind using my mind and so I lift my my hands up and I I'm go like this I, I'm not touching the wall and all of a sudden I'm like I, all of a sudden I start moving the wall this wall starts moving back and I'm literally just like mind blown I'm like this is amazing <laughs> and then and then and then somehow the dream the dream starts morphing and then all of a sudden I'm back outside where those boxes were with the beats and then I'm just jumping across the boxes again, just having a good time because every time I jump on a different box, a new beat starts playing and it was just so cool. It was just so cool. I just hear, I just hear the music like, you know, all around me and I'm like, all right, I, I want a Kid Cudi beat. I want a Kid Cudi beat. Let, give me one of those. And then I jump on this one box, Kid Cudi beat starts playing. I, I don't know if it was like an instrumental or if it was an actual song or what it was a type Kid Cudi type B I'm not sure exactly and then and then from there the dream fades out and my lucid dream experience is over and as soon as I wake up I'm like thinking back like oh, I can barely even remember like like that one scene with the trees and the sunshine and there was like a boat or or um uh, a boat or a plane in front of me. I was trying to remember like what was that scenery like because when I was actually in the dream It was incredible. It was absolutely incredible And then as soon as I woke up, it's like I, I couldn't even remember it So that that's a, that's also a topic that really fascinates me like why can't why cannot why can we not remember? All these details that happen in such vivid dreams. It's 
it's actually it's mind-blowing why we can't because it seems as real as real life but then it seems as real as the real waking life but then we can't remember these details and it's just so weird it's so weird but um yeah more videos like this coming soon and so here's some videos right here don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications bell because i'm going to be dropping a lot of videos i'm super excited about astral projection slash lucid dreaming so peace oh please keep your mind at ease it's obvious